Hi, I'm Andrea from Shatsu Body Works and I'm here with the lovely cat today who has been going through my menopause package and we're quite a way through now I think so and I've been with you for a couple of months uh, working together for a couple of months so I just thought I would ask you a couple of questions today okay. and firstly how, how were you feeling before we, we met and started working together can you remember oh my god um, a whole world different from what I'm feeling now yeah I just I didn't feel like myself I, I didn't recognize the person that I was the body that I was living in it just yeah. wasn't me uh, my brain wasn't functioning my body wasn't functioning my hormones clearly weren't functioning I just felt a mess yeah physically and mentally just yeah. fuzzy all over so um that that's where I was yeah. came to the menopause seminar of course you did yeah yeah yep. sat there with probably 40 other women all nodding going <laughs> oh my god that's me um so everything that was being described i was like oh gosh that's me that's me and it, it was really reassuring sat next to so many other people that were all going oh my god that's me too so suddenly i didn't feel like this and weird alone. freak and yeah. alone anymore yeah yeah um so yeah so i, I that was in itself was so reassuring to that's know good. that you're not isolated yeah. and you're not alone yeah. because there's not a lot that gets talked about it's not very public you sort of hear these horror stories of menopause of people just going through and having um, hysterectomies or yeah. having to battle with hrt yeah. and, and i didn't want to go yeah. down you're, that you're, route. you're coming to me cat is a young lady <laughs> <laughs> um and so were there any reservations? Obviously, at the end of the seminar, I offered anybody wanted to call back. Were there any reservations about coming for this kind of treatment? Because you didn't know about Shiatsu. I didn't. I didn't know anything about it. Never experienced it um, before. So I was coming with a completely open mind. Yeah. But I'd reached a point of desperation where yeah. I would yeah. have tried anything, to be honest, yeah. to try and resolve some of the issues that have been going on yeah. and, and feel a bit more like me. Yeah. So I did come with a completely open mind. I think that helped. Um, I agree with you, actually. Yeah. It's very much about your mindset. And I thought, it's not going to do any harm. No. If it does some good, then we're in a win-win. So okay. that was my approach to it. I just thought, let's give it a go. Brilliant. Do you think that you got any benefits right from the start? How did it I did. For you. I mean, I, I don't know. I, I'm putting faith in the process that yeah. it does what it needs to do. Yeah. But from even from the most fundamental of elements of just having time to switch off, mm. and that's probably been the most profound um, sort of conclusion of this treatment is that when I'm laid down and you're working through, you might be working on the body, but the mind. And the, the, the stress and everything that's caught up and tight up here is releasing as you're working on the body. And that, I come away and I feel lifted and lighter. And like I've almost gone through a therapy session without saying anything. Yeah. Uh, just enabling that stillness to work through. And that's amazing to hear. And I know at the end of some treatments, you're like, wow, I hadn't pieced things together, yeah. but this treatment has allowed me it, to do it that. And then... Yeah, so I come away, I feel lighter, I feel incredibly relaxed, but my mind just has been able to sort of put everything back in its little, in its little boxes. Yeah. <laughs> and the right boxes, instead yeah. of it being, I described my mind when I started as a stock room where yes. everything should be in its place in the shelves yeah. and somebody's come in and just tipped them all on the floor <laughs> and that's where my brain was starting this yeah was this big pile of mess in a stock room and at least now we're starting able to put put those boxes yeah. back on the shelves and I think there have been some physical symptoms that have relieved as well because I think you were getting incredible heat quite early in the night yeah. 10 30 11 p.m and that was really messing with your sleep pattern oh god yeah that has resolved I still get the occasional later bit of heat now yeah, yeah. and I'm certainly now able to trigger and look at when I've eaten something yes. that has reacted and I can sort of piece together the patterns there which that's I good. couldn't do before well, awareness and that's empowering that you can actually handle your yeah. own health because you're you're looking at the foods that trigger as well so that's I good know. to hear what would you say what if you had one best result so far from these shiatsu treatments the um defuzzing the brain yeah oh, oh, that's, my, oh that's been remarkable absolutely i just couldn't function like a, a human um, Gosh, it was that bad. and now i'm being able to sort of i've got that sharpness back brilliant um and 
clarity so that does help it sort of starts to wane a bit just before treatment's due again yeah and then, and then we come know in the and see me yeah yeah it's like whoa back again yes yeah. <laughs> so that's really good brilliant thank you so much for honesty that was really lovely i appreciate it thank that's you that's all right